minaliit at inakalang mahinang nila lang ang ating kababayan na si Roberto Oyan dahil sa record nito na mas marami pa ang talo kaysa panalo. Pero bago po natin simulan mga sir, kung ngayon ka palang po napadpad sa aking channel, huwag mo namang kalimutang mag-like at subscribe. Well, bago natin simulan, silipin po muna natin ang record ng dalawa. Ang Australian fighter na si Mick Shaw, may 22 na panalo, 7 talo at isang draw. Ang pito dito ay tinapos by a knockout. Habang ang ating kababayan, may 16 na panalo, 27 na po ang talo. Ang lima dito ay knockout. Kung record nga po ang pagbabasehan, talaga naman walang maniniwala na kayang manalo ng ating kababayan sa kanyang katunggali. Ngunit nagkamali nga po ng pag-istima ang Australian fighter sa ating kababayan. Napakaganda nga po ng kondisyon ni Roberto Oyan at handang gawin ng lahat ng makakaya sa laban. Atin pong panuurin ang laban kung saan apat na beses pinabagsak ang kalaban. Step and um, so underestimated fighter he is and, and as tough as they come you don't they don't get any tougher than Chris McCullen spars Mick Shaw Rick and um, yeah I've done uh, hundreds of rounds with Mick Shaw and then you know really appreciate you know him giving me the time to do the rounds and, and fighter Chris accuracy uh, good left hand and he, he's very good to the the bow hole stable uh, Mick Shaw has taken this lightly then he's in for a hard night When's danger punch, Chris? When you, what were you worried about? The overhand right. Go and punch that won him the fight against uh, Matty Powell. Yep, I missed that fight. I was I was uh, a bit busy. I was right. out seeing if he decides to stay here. Oh, did he clip Mick there? Yeah, caught him with a left hook, mate. Break. Mick, I, I don't like to see Mick Philippines now training under Team Boha. and doesn't take a backward step. He'll just come straight back. Oh, well, he's one of the most powerful boxers around. Most, pun most punters out there pick too long. You know, for him to put in such a good fight, get the decision was a little upsetting. Well, he's doing Control a... Control of the fight. Nice jab, but nice comeback. Wins, uh, he Break. might have done a bit of... Uh, done their homework on. When you can see, crafty. Oh, did he get Mick Shaw there? I think he's green. Oh, and again, this Robert Owens looking very dangerous now. I'll still give Mick Shaw that last round as well. For a couple of good overhand rights as he goes for a Shaw just doesn't seem to be spotting oh, it. Boy, Mick. That's better now. Attack again. Oh, this. Oh, Mick's yeah. down. Oh, he's been caught Two. for a left hook, I think. I thought, I thought it skimmed Four. his shoulder, that one. Five. He says the referee, Six. Derek Millam, that he's Seven. okay. Well, he looks to his corner. He slip there. No, I think that was a half slip. He might have just caught him off balance and the punch knocked him down to the ground. Oh, he's letting them go now. You can sense, a, sense an upset here. I think so. Oh, he's got Mick again for left hook. Get them hands up, Mick, and Break. get on you. When a guy's coming at you, Chris, so wild and woolly, do you look to time? He's got his back to the ropes, and it's uh, perfect for Dorian's holding centre ring, and that's when you can let them punches go. Now Mick's got centre ring, he's got to hold centre ring. Oh, he's trying to hit him too hard at the moment, Mick. He's got to go back to box and just no, let him no, go, no. and just mix hard. He's a fighter. Nice right hand from Mick. Keep them hands up nice and high. Oh, Ian just looking to measure Mick. He's caught him with that right hand. Long way at the moment. That's better. Get back to centre now, Mick. Nice right hand. Oh, it's very he's dangerous fighter, Robert Oyen, for anyone. That just can't. He's living Australian life. And Stop! Oh, Robert Oyen thought the bell had rung there, and Mick Shaw's jumped on him. So he should too, mate. Got to defend yourself at all times, I guess. Yep. There we go, the bell's caught. Down he's a 10-8 round, I'd say it's an even fight at the moment. Break! Don't pump! This fight he did uh, hurt, so hopefully, uh, you know, he's, he's fans, but for probably 
24 to 30 of that. We watched last week, obviously, Chris McCullough. Uh, very hard to describe. It was a great... So hard for the fight, and they had so many people. It was, it was uh, really good to, to pull that off the way it came off. Right. We've seen your results from last time when you got the microphone in your hand. Dude, that was pretty emotional that night, and I could have talked all night. Don't punch. Ooh. Stop. Punching on the break. Oh, that's the punch I was just talking about at the program. Where all in will slip the right hand. This is better. Mick Shaw's got to keep him here. Mick's looking to land a uh, decisive blow here. He probably needs to... Early anyway. So Mick was hoping to go the body. Now That's he's... where it gets dangerous. Nice left hook there from... A little flat here at the moment. Yeah, he's, uh, he's Seem... heavy. Doesn't seem to be moving well on his feet. Or... Doesn't seem to be beating him to the punch. That was where Mick should be jumping on him. Oh, he's hurt Mick. Oh. Mick's oh, down. Beautiful overhand right from Robert I think Robert he caught him with the left as well to, to finish him off. Mick still very Eight. hurt. The bell's rung. Glenn A's. Robert Owen will jump on him. He's landed the right hand left hook again and Mick's in trouble again. Mick should be trying to really lock him up. And as you can see, the heart of Mick Shaw, he's trying to fight with him. He's trapped in that corner and Owen will not let him out of there. Oh, my God. Both of these boys are throwing Eight. alpha leather. Oh, Mick's looking, oh, he's being caught again. He's hurt again, Mick. Frank! He is just not seeing that big right hand come over the top at him. Nah. Oh, he's in trouble. Mick's got to lock him up. Derek Millam having a very close look. He may call this off here in a second. Well, Mick's not punching back, and that's, that's when he will jump in, as he just said. And he comes back. Oh, isn't he what? Aaron strength and fight in him. And the crowd Mick to the rope now and let the bombs go. And Rob, oh, he's he could go. The longer this fight goes, the better for Rob. With Mick now being down twice and copping plenty of punishment, that's this better, is what he needs to do to Mick come. Sure, he's got Robert Owen. Oh, but Owen, great place for the fight. Oh, when he throws him, he throws him. Robert Owen, they're coming from the Philippines. Right. Feet. Oh, really good. To a minute. He's got to do it for him. Keep him away from him and not trade. He's been caught right in. He looks hurt again, Mick. Keep him there and keep going. That's better from Mick Shaw. Oh, nice uppercut. Well, as the end of the round five comes to a close, we're going to take a short break and we'll be right around. What a round it was, too. And Mick Shaw cannot get away from those ropes. Sure, isn't he? He's looking for that bomb. Nice work up onto the rope then. He got center ring. Oh, he's been caught for left hook. Has been telling tonight. He has landed at four. How do you sense it when a guy is hurt? And there's no doubt that uh, Robert sense it. Oh, he's and when you know it and the crowd know it. And now's it... but experience. They don't want to blow themselves out here if one of them can get through. You know. Oh. Robert Owens back on the attack. And the fighting's the easy part. Ten second buzzer to go. He's Chris, how do you score that one quickly? Six. Is thinking that, well, I either need to knock this guy out. If he can win these next four rounds. Oh, but he's being caught again for the center ring. He's caught Mickey. Moving from one rope to the other rope. To the other rope. Oh, he's down. On. He's called that a knockdown. Oh, I didn't Five, see any telling blow six, there that would have knocked him down. Seven, so that's the third time eight, Shaw's been down. Well, Twice six. maybe from a uh, either a combination of a slip and a, a clear knockdown. Oh, that was a very, very big knockdown, that one. And he's got Mick backing up again. You'll see Mick go to another rope. Mick Shaw. That's yeah. ring again. You see he's gone straight back to the rope Watch again. It's work, Mick Shaw. Oh, he's being tagged with a huge left hook. Mick's in serious trouble again. Oh, and the right hand. Jeez, tough Mick Shaw. And nice right. comeback himself. Oh, and is just waiting. He's caught him in the back of the head there, I think. I think it was the first right hand had him hurt. And then he... Nagtatatabling sa saya ang ating pambato. 
naakalay tapos na ang laban. Oyen's celebrating like he's won the bout. Oyen's going bizarre. His second is in the ring. Mick Shaw doesn't know what's happening. The referee just calls time out. You right to go on? Yeah, I know. Yeah. The fight's not over. No, I re- it was no knockdown. Here, here. You're coming out. You're coming out. The fight's continuing. Come on. Come on. I think it was that first right hand really hurt Mick Shaw there and then he was tagged in the back of the head which sent him down but he's in some serious trouble here as Robert Oyen's on the attack once again oh nice body shots from Robert Oyen oh and he's tagged Mick oh Mick's down again big right hand that's enough Derek Millam has said that's enough tuluyan nang natapos ang laban nang tumama ang napakalakas na kanan ng ating kababayan na si Roberto Oyan Hanggang dito na lang po muna mga sir. Sana nga po ay nagustuhan nyo ang video na ginawa ko. Email na response nga po pala. At muli, salamat.